Welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm Kakusa Blessings. We are going to answer the last year's paper, the paper which was written on 18th November 2022. Okay, before we go any further, you need to subscribe to my YouTube channel for more new videos that I will upload on this uh, channel. To set the ball rolling, uh, we are going to continue from where we ended. So we ended on uh, question three. Okay, without wasting much of the time, I will read uh, the question. So question three says, figure three shows part of the alimentary canal of a human being. Figure three shows part of the alimentary canal of a human being. So this is the alimentary canal of a human being, or you can also call it as a digestive system of a human being. So question 3a says, identify the parts labeled P and Q. Identify the parts labeled P and Q. So if you are able to start these parts uh, clearly, you can be able to tell that. Uh, the part labeled P is what is known as the osophagus. So the part labeled P is the osophagus. Or you can also call the part labeled P as uh, the gallet. This is just the other name of uh, the osophagus. The gallet. Okay. And the part labeled Q. So the part labeled Q is commonly known as uh, the stomach. Part labeled Q is uh, the stomach. Okay. So that is the stomach there. B is saying, explain the function of the part labeled R in digestion. Explain the function of the part labeled R in digestion. First of all, you need to identify what part R is. So part R is uh, a pancreas. So a pancreas plays uh, various roles in digestion. And those roles are... Uh, a pancreas uh, it uh, produces pancreatic juice so you can say at B the pancreas or you should not state the, the name of the, the part they have asked you can just say part R part R But R produces pancreatic juice. Okay, so it is in that pancreatic juice where we find uh, a lot of uh, things. So in that pancreatic juice, we've got uh, the sodium hydrogen carbonate, and we've also got the trypsin. We've got the lipase and pancreatic amylase. So all those things are contained in the pa pancreatic juice. So the other roles played by uh, R are that uh, uh, the sodium hydrogen carbonate neutralizes the acid scheme. So we can say the sodium hydrogen carbonate carbonate hydrolyzes uh, sorry neutralizes neutralizes uh, neutralizes the acid kim the acid kim So you may wonder what a chem is. 
uh, a king is simply a paste a paste uh, formed by rhythmic contraction of the muscles in the stomach yes that's a king so the other role played by ara is that that's pancreatic amylase which con which is contained in in the pancreas breaks down starch to form maltose so pancreatic amylase pancreatic amylase breaks down breaks down starch uh, to form maltose maltose okay we move on to see C is saying state two functions of the part labeled S. State two functions of the part labeled S. So the part labeled S is what is known as uh, the lever. That's a lever there. So the part labeled S. So this is C. the part labeled S uh, uh, functions by storing vitamins. Uh, it stores, so you can say it stores vitamins. So vitamins uh, addict. Addict. Can you even put addict in brackets like this? So addict is just uh, vitamin A, vitamin D, vitamin E, and vitamin K are stored in the part labeled uh, S, which is uh, the liver. So the other function played by the part labeled S is just to uh, to emulsify fats. It plays a role in the emulsification, emulsification of fats. Of fats. Yes, uh, it's also functions in that way so emulsification is the breakdown of large drops of fat into small droplets okay so uh, the part labeled S also uh, functions by it also functions by by detoxification of uh, poisons and alcohol by converting them into less toxic substances so it is also used in detoxification. Detoxification, detoxification of poisons and alcohols into less 